Hey what's up everyone and welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video we'll be showing you how you can upload beats on BeatStars and then sell them for money. So people have been using BeatStars to upload their beats whether it's original or remixed and then and then they were able to make a lot of money selling these beats. I'm going to show you how you can upload your beat and then select the pricing so that you can make money using this website. So to get started head over to Beats. So to get started, head over to BeatStars.com and then log in your account if you have one. If you don't have an account, you can easily sign up by pressing on this button and then walking through the process of creating an account. You can also create your account using Facebook, Twitter, Google or Apple. They will send a verification code to your email, so go ahead and grab that and then paste it right here. After creating an account, we will learn how we can upload a beat and then put it up for sale. So head over to studio and then from here you need to fill in your artist profile by adding your first name, last name and then your professional name and location. You can upload a profile picture and this will all make your profile look better and then this will also help you sell more beats in the long run. If you just want to get through the process of uploading a beat and then putting it up for sale, and then filling this information later, you can easily click on remind me later and then do it at a different time. You can see stats such as how many people played your beats, free posts, comments, and then comments, net sales, and so on. You want to click on create so that we can start and then creating it and putting it up for sale. So click on create and then hit create track. You'll be taken right here to see the kind of plans that you want to be creating your beats with. So choose the plan that suits you, but you can also stick with the free plan and it will give you up to 10 tracks and it will give you up to 10 tracks for upload. So it's not bad at all. Click on create track under production tracks. And this is where the upload process takes place. So now we're moving on to the uploading stage. So now we move to the uploading process and as you can see there will be an the upload a beat which is the untagged audio. This is basically the file that people will be able to access and do whatever they want with after they buy the beat. For the track stems this is optional to upload but it will contain every file that will be included in your beat. And for the tagged audio this is what people will be able to view. When people play a preview of your file, they'll be able to find the file from before they purchase it and to ensure that they don't just, you know, take it or record it or download the free version and use it however they want before buying it, you will be adding some kind of noise or for example a shout out in the middle of your beat so that you ensure that doesn't happen. So let's get to the uploading process. Upload the beat that you have by pressing on this button and then dropping your beat file right here. The website itself will help you generate a tagged version for your audio, but if you don't like it, you can just simply press on the upload button and then upload the file that you want. Once you've done that, click on next step and this is really where you tag your beat. You can select an artwork for it and then a title, the type of beat that it is. You can add a description, make it public, private or unlisted. And once you've added all this information, click on the next step, which is the metadata. If you want to be done with it really quickly, then you can use this autofill metadata option, which will enable autofill and then it will analyze your beat and then select the correct tags and genres for it. You can double check just to make sure and then edit it later if you want to. After that, you can add the collaborators from this tag if there are any other people that helped you create your beat. For this step here, we want to add the pricing. So we have the basic license and then we have the premium license, which enables enables the wave form of the beat and then there's the free or tagged version of the beat so you can select the price for the beat as you like and once you've chosen a price that's suitable to you click on the next step and then you will review your entire application and process and if everything checks out then simply click on publish track and it will be live. Once you've uploaded your beat, it will tell you track released and then you can share it by copying this link or directly sharing it within your social media applications. And that will be all for today's video. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this video helpful on how you can upload a beat and put it up for sale, let us know in the comments and subscribe for future videos.